guys welcome back to my channel this is your girl charlotte and thank you so much for tuning in happy sunday so guys it's sunday so your girl has a new cooking video for you today yay so i'm just doing this quick intro i'm really not home i traveled to new york and i'm just doing this quick intro for you guys so i hope you stay tuned enjoy the video so let me say we are making some peanut butter soup today okay i'm showing you guys how to make peanut butter soup so if you love peanut butter soup you want to learn how to make it stay tuned watch this video to the end and don't forget to like comment share the video and if you haven't done so just subscribe to the channel okay guys this is 2023 let's upgrade help your girl hit thousand subscribers okay real soon real quick okay so yes enjoy the video watch to the end learn how to cook peanut butter soup please do okay bye and i will see you in my next one so to get started out here i have my pot on the fire on the stove i put in some cow food i already pre-boiled it and now i'm adding some uh smoke fowl chicken or hard chicken um as you can see i have a lot of smoke going on in there i have some smoke fish <laughs> and then last thing i'm gonna add is some fresh fish yes so after i put all my meat in the pot i am gonna go ahead and start seasoning and i'm starting by putting some onions That is just um, one medium onion and I'm adding three Maggi cubes, some salt. You guys know me with this whole measurement thing, okay? I measure with my eyes. <laughs> now I'm adding some black pepper. So yes, the seasoning according to your taste okay you can put whatever season you want so now i'm just adding some um paprika and i have this chicken well yeah so um seasoning that i'm adding in there and then I'm going to go ahead and put um, one tablespoon of tomato paste. And here I have my vegetable and pepper. Um, I have the scarbonet and then I have one um, bell pepper. So I'm going to blend that all together with enough water. I didn't mind having enough water because it's going to soup. All that water is going to make the soup so do enough water yeah so i'm gonna i'm gonna blend the peppers blend that low on low and it's ready for the pots So yes, that's how I start off my soup. When I'm making soup, I make sure I put everything I want. If I need more pepper, I'm going to drop some pepper pores in there. But for now, I just blend those. I know it seems like it's a lot, but hey, I'm a Liberian, okay? I do pepper. Not every Liberian do pepper, but I do. So yeah. So if I don't have enough peppers, I will add a little bit later. But I'm going to cook this soup first and see. Man. So here I'm just adding some water. I'm going to put enough water in there. You know. To get everything started. So I cook the soup. You know. Make sure the meat is boiled. The meat is done not done all the way but halfway done before i put the rest of the water in there so now i'm just gonna parboil my meat 
so here I have some peanut butter and this is like a homemade kind like there's no sugar in it nothing it would just blend it like peanuts blend that's it no sugar no added nothing so yeah that's what I'm making my soup with so I'm gonna strain that um for this part i know people would just take the peanut butter from the people would just take peanut butter from the bottle and into the soup i have tried it and i didn't like the outcome it was just not the texture i was looking for so this worked for me it's up to you to do it yes yeah, so after boiling for a little while, this is how my meat is. I still have some juice going on in there. I'm going to add in my peanut butter. And next thing I'm going to do is add more water. And the water I'm adding right now is what is going to cook my soup. So for this stage, I put enough water according to how much soup I want to have in the end. And I will know my soup is ready and done when I get the consistency that I'm looking for, okay? So some people eat this with rice, some people eat it with fufu. When you eat it with fufu, you want it to be more soup-like and... If you're doing it with both, you do the texture you want, okay? Just whatever that is pleasing to you. Yeah, so after boiling some for some time, some people will leave their soup at this stage. But, and this will be good for some fufu. Yeah, but I let it boil for some time. And at that stage, I'm ready. I just add in three more of my bonnet, my scott bonnet, just in case. If somebody is eating the soup and they want more pepper, they go for it. So you see the texture right there. I'm just going to let that pop, uh, me pepper boil a little bit and then my soup will be ready. But at this point, some people will just stop here, okay? And if that's you, then your soup is ready. If you are looking for the texture that I'm looking for, then a little bit more, then good. So guys, tell me what you think. Please make this soup and tell me in the comment section how delicious your soup was. Because mine is off the hook, okay? It is beyond delicious. I hope you guys enjoy watching this video because I enjoy making it for you, alright? So have fun, enjoy, and I will see you in my next video.